What's up guys, welcome back to another HD commentary, my name is Bob and today we're going to be showing you how to boost your microphone quality in Audacity for those who don't have an equalizer or a mixer at home this is definitely going to help you and I did this previously on my Draven video and that sounds awesome so before uh, we're going to get started of course you have to download this program so it's called Audacity, it's completely free, you can download it on the internet, just google it and there will be a link to download it for free and nothing more actually to add on that so let's get started if you have Audacity you have your, your voice right here you can record it with the, the red dot and once you have your voice um, and you don't really have a, that good of a mic quality then it's gonna sound something like this hey there my name is Bob and today we're gonna be playing some League of Legends and as you can hear, if I say that right now, Hey there, my name is Bob, and today we're going to be playing some League of Legends. It sounds a lot better already, because I have a equalizer. I bought that for around 140 bucks or something, so that shit is expensive. And there is another way to do this, for those who don't want to pay for it, and that is in Audacity. So, you, uh, when you record something, you probably have noise. This is completely normal. You have your laptop fan spinning on the background. And with good microphones, you usually hear these kind of sounds. So you want to get rid of that. There's a way to do this in Audacity, a very easy way. You select the part where uh, you're not talking. So you need to have a, a space where you have not talked and you only hear the background noises. So once you select that, you just drag it, you select and drag, and then you go to Effect, up here, and you're going to be looking for Noise Removal. Now, it's right over here, Noise Removal in the English version, and you're going to be doing step one. So select a few seconds of, of just noise, so Audacity knows what to filter out. So you just did that, you selected it, and you're going to be pressing the button, Get Noise Profile. Bam. All right, so now it has it. Now you want to select the entire uh, track because you want to get the noise out of the entire track and not only that little part. And then you're going to go back to noise removal and go to step two. Now, usually I don't really change anything right here. I'm not sure if it's if you should be doing that, but for me, it's not necessary. I can just press OK and it will get rid of all the noise. Hey there, my name is Bob and today we're going to be playing some League of Legends. Alright, so you, you barely hear any background noises anymore, so that's great. We got rid of that, but still the quality of the microphone is not that good and we want to get it a little bit better. So, once again, you're going to be selecting the entire track because you're going to work with the entire track. Go to Effect. And before we get started, you're going to be doing a... Um, or no, let's just get started right away. So, you have this thing called Equalization. In LST. And once you select it, you get something like this. Now, it is important to know how this works. So I'm going to show you how it works. Uh, right now, it's just set to zero. Uh, zero dB, nothing really happened. So this is pure your microphone quality. But we can change it because uh, the left side of this ref is the base. So if we, if we hire this, say we hire this and then have it go like that and then something like that and we're going to be pressing ok then you're going to be seeing that the bass is a lot higher hey there my name is bob and today we're going to be playing some league of legends so the bass is already higher and uh but it's not enough because you're not hearing that uh radio quality that you want to hear so we're going to go back um you can you can adjust this like you would like to do it i mean there are different ways to do it but there is one general way that works really well and that is to have a uh, high lows and high highs and i just have to figure out how that exactly works here because i haven't used audacity in quite a while so let's try something like this this is this doesn't look real real nice but we're gonna be trying it out Hey there, my name is Bob, and today we're going to be playing some League of Legends. Well, as you can hear, <laughs> it definitely has some improved sound quality. Uh, now we have this. Hey there, my name is Bob. And we have this. Hey there, my name is Bob. So that is definitely a difference, and of course, now it's a little bit too much, because those highs really sound crappy. So we want to have that a little bit lower, um, 
especially this middle part we don't want it to be too much let's just have it like this you kind of have to sort this out for yourself and see what fits your voice because it's not the same for every voice but for me this this, this usually works so we're going to be pressing ok and let listen hey there my name is bob and today we're going to be playing some league of legends well, that, that kind of sounds like my microphone, doesn't it, right now? <laughs> and that's exactly what I mean. If you do this right, you're going to get a much better quality than you had before. And that will definitely boost your audio quality in your videos. So, now we have this. Hey there, my name is Bob, and today we're going to be playing some League of Legends. And we had this. Hey there, my name is Bob. So you definitely can hear the difference. Alright, so let me just go back and uh, press OK on that. So once you have that, you want to compress it. The last thing we're going to be doing. So compressor here, right? Go to effect and go to compressor. And it's going to be something like this. Now, this threshold, that's really a thing you want to look at. Because that's going to determine how loud your video is going to be. A compressor compresses your sound like it says. Uh, my mixer has it in it by itself, but if you don't have a mixer once again, then you you probably need this because if you're going to be screaming, you don't want people to get deaf. Uh, you want the the audio to be some kind of normalized to have it all at the same level and not uh, very silent parts and very loud parts because that's going to mess you up when you're watching a video. So we're going to be leaving the threshold on 12 minus 12 dB. Press OK. And as you can see, everything got a little bit louder because we don't want to have a really silent video and we don't ha want to have a really loud video. So it's going to be normalizing it throughout the entire track and it's going to be trying to put it all at the same level or sort of. Hey there, my name is Bob and today we're going to be playing some League of Legends. And now it sounds really, really crisp and good. So this is basically what you want to have. Then you can cut out these beginning parts by selecting it, press delete, bam. Uh, also, the last part, you're going to be removing that. Then, go to File, Export. And you're just going to be calling it blah, 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 blah. Or something, just or League of Legends. You're going to be saving it as a WAV, just normal, normal things. You're not going to be changing anything from that. Save it. Uh, also, just press OK here. And you're done. You have nice quality for your video. You can just select it and put it into your video and... Voila! So, thank you for watching this uh, tutorial. I hope it was useful for some of you guys. I basically made this for Mario, Aquili Mario. I will have his channel in the description. You can check him out. He's a cool dude. Um, he bought my microphone, my previous one, and he's wondering how to get that sound that I got with that microphone. And that's basically like this. So, also, if you don't have that microphone, I have a Blue Yeti. But you can do it with any microphone probably and it works and it sounds a lot better. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, have fun with it. If you liked the video, please press, press that like button and subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. See you later.